Hey, good morning, Chris here. Part 5 of this solar cradle system I'm doing in the backyard of suburbia here. Coming along real good. Got lots of work done the past couple of days. And just want to show you the progress. And it is about 7.30 in the morning right now, which is good to show you that look at the sun hitting this thing already. And I just got the cradle system done here, but as you know, this whole thing, this pergola extension is going to come down. The panel is going to get moved over here, of course, as you know. So let's get right into the nitty gritty. The stockade posts are filled with precision grout went really really good this cross member here oh my goodness that strengthened up those corners immensely immensely and then I put in three posts there in the, in the center and bang those down into the earth And if anyone can tell me, that's all precision grout in there with just a little bit of concrete mixed in with that white stuff. Is this is I just poured this yesterday. This morning, it's got this white residue. If anyone can tell me what that is, let me know. All tractor supply grade 8 bolts and hardened washers. Attached to the stockade post I put in the fence line here. Those are grout filled too. And I've got three cans of Rust-Oleum brown satin paint. I'm going to work on that today. Take off all the stickers and take some steel wool and clean it up and squirt it. Look at the uh, look at the angle. Can you see that? It actually turned out really, really good and straight. It's about 58, 59 degrees, which is kind of, it's ideal for Oklahoma here at this location is about 53, 54. Uh, so this is going to lean a little bit more flat. And so this will take advantage of a little bit more of the summer angles which I need for powering and stuff. So, look at that. The sun's hitting almost all of that. May 5th, 2016. I gotta remember that. Oh, I gotta show you one thing down here. See that back corner right there? That hole right there was a booger <laughs> to dig because of the stump right there but I got it I got it in he's a bigger hammer <laughs> but the corner up there if I could tell you how strong that is <laughs> with the cross bracing right here really really good and strong now the center is still a little bit wobbly it's because it's wobbly this way it's not wobbly this way but once you put the, the racking system on here, that'll strengthen up that center big time. Let's go over here. This is what I came up for the cross braces. Drilling holes through 14 gauge. Um, <clears throat> let's just say that's is a booger. Morning, bud. My helper. And still don't know. If you can tell me what you would do with these, let me know. Because I, I don't know if I want to chop those off or leave them or do something with them. I don't know, make a popsicle stand or something. I don't know. 
but um, yeah, this is going to be good. Let's look at the sun. I'm going to stand over here in the corner. This is the corner of my lot, okay? Right here in the corner. Now let's pan over to the sun. See there? Barely even 8 o'clock. Now you know why I put this solar racking system right here. And you see the panels over there? Zero sun. Those things won't even touch sun until about 9.30. So my early morning power gets going. Okay. Now let me show you something else. So I walk along the back fence line. I'm trying to keep quiet because the neighbors are, you know, you gotta, gotta be nice and respectful. Look at there. Look at the sun in this corner. Morning. She likes the sun. Okay. Here's my solar panel rail on the fence line. Now look at the sun. See what I'm talking about? <laughs> I'm going to wash these here in a minute. But that's why I moved... See these 12 are on the pergola over there, and I moved them over here. And this this south-facing fence just bakes in the sun all day. And the next project is going to be getting these E20 laminates off this. I'm going to put them on that side, and I'm going to angle, build a, a cradle for that right there. Of course, that's going to all be torn down. So it's going to take advantage of the setting sun. So my late afternoon angles will be good. So. <sighs> <coughs> Excuse me. All right, need, need to get going here and get this video uploaded and get to work. Thanks for watching, guys. Appreciate it. And uh, please leave a comment below, like, dislike. Hit the share button, too. That'll uh, hopefully help other folks out who see these videos and know that you can do it yourself in suburbia here with solar panels, renewable energy, self-sufficiency. So, take care, guys. Later.